from an off-duty Edmonton cop using his quick instincts to disarm man with a loaded rifle to a red deer father getting a school bus with an impaired driver to come to a halt, there was no shortage of Albertans who jumped into action in various situations requiring bravery in 201617 and a number of them were honored in Edmonton on Friday. Alberta's Lieutenant Gov. Lois E. Mitchell was joined by Edmonton Police Chief Rod Knecht and other dignitaries at the Edmonton Police Service, EPS, headquarters on Friday afternoon to hand out the Royal Canadian Humane Association Bravery Awards. The Royal Canadian Humane Association was established in Canada by Queen Victoria in 1894 to honor people who through their alertness, skill and concern, bring about the saving of life, especially where those actions lie outside the ordinary duties of the person involved, according to an EPS news release. The accolades are separated into different categories. Bravery medals are given to people who have shown their willingness to sacrifice themselves to save others. Gold medals are mostly only given out for deeds of bravery at the cost of the hero's life. Silver or bronze medals are given to people who have shown extraordinary disregard for personal safety in saving or attempting to save a life. Honorary testimonial certificates are given out for rescue attempts where the risk is not as great. Below is a look at some of the people who were honored at Friday's ceremony. Neil Seyfedin was given a silver medal for bravery. John Wajeris was given a bronze medal for bravery and Ryan Brewster and Benjamin Sachs were given honorary testimonial certificates for their efforts to try and save a woman from a burning SUV in Edmonton. On October 24, 2016, a woman was driving her SUV when it was hit by a speeding car in the area of 97th Street and 160 Avenue. Both vehicles went into the ditch, hers rolled and caught fire. Seyfedin ran to her SUV and pulled the broken windshield away to try and get her out but she was pinned. He then grabbed a fire extinguisher and tried to put the blaze out. Wajaris then arrived on the scene and tried to get the woman out as well. Brewster and Sachs also stopped to help and tried to use fire extinguishers to put out the fire. Despite their efforts, the woman, 50-year-old Joan Christou, died. Read more. Edmonton citizens and police officer recognized for trying to save woman from burning vehicle. Watch below, on May 17, 2017, Sarah Krause filed this report about some Edmontonians who were recognized for their heroic attempts to save the life of a woman trapped in a burning vehicle. Jihad Shahad was given a silver medal for bravery and Cooper Davies was given a bronze medal for bravery for their roles in helping to disarm a gunman in Calgary. On January 10, 2016, a man got out of a car in front of 10 nightclub and started firing shots into the bar. A man inside the club was injured so Chahad and Davies both bouncers at the club rushed into action. Chahad tried to disarm the gunman and the gun went off and a bullet went through his jacket still, he was able to disarm the man and Davies rushed in to help. They held the man on the ground until police arrived.